No, we're not doing a run. All right. Sir, do this we got to neutralize those turrets. I grab this BR easy peasy. Rocket that guy. Sometimes there's a grunt here. Sometimes all three of them are up there. Either is whichever way it is. Just be aware of that. All right, let's grab a couple of nades here. We'll take those. Thank you. All right. Then as soon as that audio cue starts, you want to fire a rocket right around there. 99% of the time, you'll kill the sniper that's right there. Very, very easy to do. Then we're just going to hit a load, which is right here at this bush. And then turn back around, and I'm going to basically skip everything at the start of this. The reason why I go backwards right here instead of walking forward is, number one, there are four sniper jackals around the corner up there. Number two, walking that way spawns in wraiths in the next section that we're going to, and we don't want to do any of that. Hey, Kenway. What's up, CPO? Artillery disabled, Sergeant. Let's see how good I am, chat. Let me see if I can still I remember how to do the uh, grenade launch across this thing. All right. So I'm going to blow up one ghost so these guys can't chase me. Sometimes they target you right there. Just don't get too close to them. Be aware that those elites will shoot at you. And then you don't have to do this. You can lower the bridge, but I'm going to see just how good I am. Ah! Oh, we're clean. It's not even close. It's too easy. All right. I'm going to go back to right about there to make sure I trigger the waterfall load, and then we're going back out of bounds. What's up, Mr. Mud? How's it going, man? What's up, Tanib? All right. The out-of-bounds driving here is relatively easy. Okay. All right, then I'm going to grab these rocks right here. Then all I'm doing is going down here and hitting a load, and then we're going right back out of the map. Just on the lower lip of that ramp, you'll get a check if you did it right. Boom. And we're going back up the way we came. What's up, Goldeneye? How's it going? Okay, this dip right here is a little weird, so hit it from this angle to give yourself a little bit more safety, because sometimes you'll just fall off this thing. That drop down right here is it's just a little awkward. All right. These guys right here will always shoot you, even if you have envy which I guess you won't because uh, you're getting ready to get it right now. But those guys just always know where you are. It's awkward. All right, let's do a little grenade jumping action. We'll snag this. Boom. Because we're going to want that for the rest of the game anyway. All righty. little easy grenade jump here. And then we are out of there. So now there's a couple of things you can do. You can either walk through here and go for a sword fly, which I am not going to do. I'm going to do the way that 99% of people are going to probably go if you wanted to do something like this, which is to backtrack and go grab the ghost and go around. Besides, I want to grab a beam rifle at the end, and I want to... Uh, I want to despawn the um, the jackal snipers. Don't have to do that. You can just shoot them, but I'm going to despawn them. What's up, Godsend? How's it going? Uh, 
Uh, it's not that it's inconsistent. It's just that uh, most people that are doing this are going to be playing on H2A. And uh, the sword flight to get through there on H2A, you don't have envy. And sometimes you just get sniped at. So I'm trying to give a path that is the most consistent. Wow, Confu, you are a weirdo. Hello. How's it going? Alrighty. Hello, Gladiator. Alright, so we've already hit all the loads that we need to hit, except for these ones right here at the very end. Don't need the ghost anymore, so we just walk off and land on this. Then we're gonna hit a trigger right here. Good. Still no word about in amber clad on the Covenant battle net. So as soon as Cortana says battle net, you know you're good Covenant to go. Landfall, but I'm gonna walk down here with this area side. unloaded. Spawn in all the drones. They are now in void space. Now I can go back and hit the load correctly. And everything right here is gone. No problem. So boom. We hit this. We're good to go. And now just for the sake of consistency, I'm going to just use BR and... Uh, VR and um, noob combo to just kill these guys. All I'm doing is juggling weapons so I don't have to walk back up here. Because I want to end this. Oh, wait a minute. I want to end this with beam rockets, not uh, rocket sword. Wrong juggle. That's okay. Oh, wait a minute. No, I don't either. I want to end this. I got to think here. Because I have envy, I need to do a sword fly. So I think I need to end this with beam sword and not take the rockets over. Okay, look at me. Look at me almost making a mistake. That's okay, though. All right, so we're going to end with beam sword, not rocket sword. So grabbing that rocket ammo did not matter, but that's okay. All right, so you're going to have four elites here at the end. Take them out. You got the first two, and then you'll have two more. This guy right here, easy kill. Now, one thing to note is that this level will not end until you go inside toward Regret's Hologram. So standing right here or doing whatever is fine. So if you forgot something, you can go back and get it as long as you don't walk back into the room. Hey, Brains, how's it going, man? Um, one last thought here before I finish this level. Yeah, because I don't have the H2A uh, jumps to go across, so I need to have the sword here. Yeah, this is correct. Sword and beam. Okay, done deal. So we end the level, 831. Cool. Uh...